Shalom, God bless you. I welcome you all in the name of Jesus. This is the word and declaration with Lynette. If this is your first time seeing me or coming across my channel, thank you so much for stopping by. God bless you. Please kindly like, share and subscribe so you'll become part of this awesome family. As for my returning subscribers, you are family to me. I love you and I will keep praying and interceding for you. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you for today, Lord. We give you praise. Father, we worship you for there is no one like you. Father, we pray for this word that is about to come forth. I pray for everyone that is ready to receive. I pray, O King of glory, that may you make this word manifest speedily in their lives. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. The Lord says, someone is in so much pain because of you. This person feels so ashamed. You know, when you were going through a very difficult moment in your life, this person looked at you, they felt like that is the end of you. They felt like good things are not meant for you. Because God was blessing them at the moment, they felt like it was all about them. Now the table has turned and things are falling in pleasant places for you. This person is in so much pain. This is because they felt like life revolved only around them. The Bible says Hannah was believing God for a child. She prayed for so many years, believing God for a child. Her co-wife Benina had so many children. She kept on mocking at Hannah. She kept on laughing at Hannah, thinking that Hannah would never give birth to a child, thinking that the world and their marriage revolves around her. Despite the fact that Hannah's husband gave her all the love and attention, but she wanted a child of her own. The Lord says, I should tell you, no matter your situation, no matter what you're going through right now, keep on believing, keep on praying. And when the right time comes, he is going to give you what you seek of him. Do not care what people are saying about you. Do not care about those that are laughing and mocking at you. Do not care about those that have given up on you. If you stay faithful to him, if you continue to connect to his word, if you continue to be faithful and prayerful, God is going to grant your heart desire in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I hope you receive this word with gladness. Please do not forget to turn on your notification bell so whenever I upload new content, you will be the first to know. I love you all so much, family. I'll see you in our next session. God bless you. Shalom.